five types of opposition you may be facing and why. Nate Johnston, Gold Coast, Australia, five types of opposition you may be facing. 1. Opposition to the deeper reset, rest. This is where the enemy wars against you entering the secret place, bombarding you with busyness, striving, pressure to get things done, and sudden, overwhelming distractions. The healing and heart clearing is so important right now, and for some of you, God is doing a complete makeover, cutting hidden ties, and removing wounds and trauma you didn't even know you were carrying. 2. Opposition of clarity to receive revelation, blueprints. This is where the enemy sends chatter and words against you, where the atmosphere feels foggy and confusion tries to set in, and while God is always speaking, it feels like the pieces don't connect or they seem unclear. For many people, this is manifested in the battle of the mind coming against them right now, and the temptation to fall back into old mindsets, fears, and panic, but it has mainly been coming through people's words of mockery and judgment. The war against you to receive is happening because the delivery is vital right now. 3. Opposition on your voice. In a time where the pure and clear prophetic has never been needed more, there has been an obvious assignment to shut down voices rising up. Often disguised as wisdom, safeguarding, and protecting purity, which are all necessary, this imposter spirit wants to shut down the prophetic by causing division and fault-finding. It's a critical spirit which, instead of broadcasting hope, is broadcasting opinions and agendas. This causes true voices of hope to shut down and hide. 4. Opposition on what God is building in you. This is where the enemy directly hits you in the very area God is really adding favor, anointing, conviction, and vision. He wants to sabotage it by making you second-guess yourself, bringing in controlling people and measures to taint it, or causing delays and setbacks, closed doors in the places God has promised. Photo via public domain pictures. 5. Opposition to your mantle and new mission, appointment. This is very much the same as the opposition against what God is building in you but, specifically, this opposition comes as a direct result of the noticeable increase you have stepped into, and the office, appointment you have before you. The enemy sees the new mantle, and your sudden fire and rising authority, and has been warring against the appointment with weariness and disappointment. This is where you need wisdom and discernment to know that you aren't taking on yokes, the wrong armor, or other people's stuff, but only taking on what God anoints and mantles you with. Why am I dealing with opposition right now? 1. God is taking you from glory to glory. Your story is changing. Your track history is changing. 2. God is lifting you out of a whole way of living that you've become way too used to. He is administering his healing bomb, restoration, and justice from many years ago. It's the line in the sand so you can move fully into this season. 3. New blueprints and vision are coming to you. You are in a new, unknown era and God is giving you clear GPS directions, coordinates, and mission details for you to steward and walk out. 4. Your once hidden, squashed, silenced, and timid voice is suddenly roaring from within you and making its way to the surface. You have no agenda, no territory to selfishly protect, and no motives or self-promotion, and the earth needs the pure sound of your voice to cut through the noise. 5. God is building you, establishing you, anointing you afresh, and moving through you in a way you have not seen him do. Photo via Unsplash. 6. You have been commissioned by God in the wilderness and now you are coming out of that season with a weighty governmental mantle and call to the nations to see them come to Jesus. So how do I respond? 1. Take higher ground. Pursue the secret place. Fight for it. It says in Hebrews chapter 4 verse 11, Let us, therefore, make every effort to enter that rest. It can be difficult in pressure but it's the only place you can get free, clear. Be armored up. Take communion regularly. 2. Rebuke the wind and waves. This is your offensive stance. Get out the word and bind up what is coming at you. Clear the atmosphere. Tell the opposition to stop in Jesus' name. 3. Shake it off and move on. In Acts chapter 18 verse 6 it says, But when they opposed and insulted him, he shook out his garments and told them, Your blood be on your own heads. I am innocent of it. From now on I will go to the Gentiles. Don't let opposition stop you, hold you back, or slow you down. 4. Keep your vision before you regardless of what you see. Write down the vision, prophesy it, steward your promises, and guard them with your life. Look at what God is doing. We must keep our eyes on Jesus more than the storm, or than any pandemic. What is God doing and saying over you right now? Asterisk please don't miss our emerging and newly found prophets. Subscribe here.
Nate Johnston Everyday Revivalists email everydayrevivalists at gmail.com website, nateandchristy.co. Nate Johnston is a revivalist and worshipper who has a heart to see sons and daughters unleashed into passionate friendship with God and an effective supernatural lifestyle. Through his ministry, Everyday Revivalists, he teaches on intimacy and hearing God's voice which was birthed from a hunger for authentic, real, and powerful relationship with Jesus. Nate and Christy have two daughters, Charlotte and Sophie, and currently live on the Gold Coast in Australia. Find us on, asterisk Facebook, click here, asterisk XAPIT, click here. Please forward to all your friends. Permission granted, and you are also encouraged, to reprint these articles in hard copy form, as well as sending them to your own email lists and posting them on your own websites. We ask only that you keep Elijah List website, email contact info, and author contact information intact. Elijah List Publications 528 Ellsworth Street, Southwest Albany, Oregon, 97321 www.elijahlist.com Email, info at elijahlist.net Phone 1-541-926-3250